RSV in older adults, the risks, prevention, and management, this video is not intended for medical advice. It is for informational purposes only. It's essential to reach out to your health care professional to get advice for your particular circumstance, and know that this video should not be used in place of their advice and input. As we age, our immune system becomes more vulnerable to certain infections, including respiratory illnesses. One such infection that can pose a risk to older adults is respiratory syncytial virus infection, RSV. In this video, we will delve into the details of RSV infection in older adults, exploring its symptoms, risks, preventive measures, and management strategies. Whether you're a concerned family member or a senior yourself, this video aims to equip you with valuable knowledge to protect and care for older adults during RSV seasons. Understanding of RSV, Respiratory Syncytial Virus Respiratory syncytial virus, commonly known as RSV, is a viral infection that primarily affects the respiratory system. It is highly contagious and can spread through respiratory droplets when an infected person coughs or sneezes. RSV can survive on surfaces for hours, making it easy to contract the virus by touching contaminated objects and then touching the face. How RSV spreads RSV spreads through close contact with infected individuals or contaminated surfaces. Common sources of RSV infection include hospitals, long-term care facilities, and crowded environments where people congregate during peak seasons. It is essential to understand how RSV spreads to take appropriate preventive measures. Identifying RSV symptoms in older adults. Recognizing the symptoms of an RSV infection in older adults is crucial for timely intervention. While symptoms can vary, seniors infected with RSV often experience persistent coughing, often accompanied by wheezing, shortness of breath and trouble breathing. Fever, usually low-grade, stuffy or runny nose, sore throat, fatigue and general malaise. It's important to note that RSV symptoms in older adults can sometimes mimic those of other respiratory illnesses, making accurate diagnosis essential for effective management. Risks and complications associated with RSV in older adults. Three groups that are at higher risk for complications from RSV include, adults with heart or chronic lung disease, those individuals with a weakened immune system, and older adults. Vulnerability of older adults to RSV. The immune system naturally weakens with age, making older adults more susceptible to infections like RSV. This reduced immune response hampers the body's ability to fight off the virus effectively. As a result, seniors may experience more severe symptoms and a higher risk of complications. Potential complications. RSV can lead to various complications in older adults, including respiratory problems such as bronchitis and pneumonia. These complications can exacerbate pre-existing health conditions, such as chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, COPD, or congestive heart failure, and increase the risk of hospitalization. Preventive measures for RSV in older adults. Taking preventive measures is crucial to protect older adults from RSV. By following a few simple strategies, you can minimize the risk of exposure and reduce the likelihood of infection. Vaccination for RSV while there is currently no specific RSV vaccine available for older adults, staying up to date with other routine vaccinations can help support overall respiratory health. Vaccines for influenza and pneumococcal disease, for instance, can lower the risk of complications if an RSV infection occurs. Personal hygiene practices, practicing good hand hygiene is a fundamental preventive measure. Wash your hands frequently with soap and water for at least 20 seconds, especially before eating after using the restroom, and after being in public spaces. If soap and water are not readily available, use an alcohol-based hand sanitizer with at least 60% alcohol. Social distancing and avoiding crowded places during peak RSV seasons, it's advisable for older adults to avoid crowded places and maintain social distancing. This helps reduce the risk of exposure to RSV-infected individuals and minimizes the chances of contracting the virus. Managing RSV in Older Adults if an older adult develops symptoms suggestive of an RSV infection, it is essential to seek medical attention promptly. Early diagnosis and proper management can significantly impact the outcome and minimize complications. Treatment options for RSV There is no specific antiviral medication available for treating RSV in older adults. However, healthcare providers may prescribe supportive care measures to alleviate symptoms and manage complications. Rest, hydration, and maintaining a clean and comfortable environment are essential for a speedier recovery. 
home remedies and self-care tips. In addition to medical treatment, there are self-care measures that can help manage RSV symptoms at home. Adequate rest, staying hydrated, and using humidifiers or nasal saline sprays to ease nasal congestion can provide relief and support recovery. FAQs Is RSV more severe in older adults compared to younger individuals? Older adults are at higher risk of experiencing severe complications from RSV due to age-related changes in the immune system. Additionally, pre-existing health conditions can further increase susceptibility and worsen the impact of RSV. It is important to promptly seek medical attention if symptoms occur. Can RSV be treated with antiviral medication? There is no specific antiviral medication available for treating RSV in older adults. However, healthcare providers may prescribe supportive care measures to alleviate symptoms and manage complications. Rest, hydration, and a comfortable environment play a crucial role in recovery. It is essential to follow the healthcare professional's guidance for personalized treatment. How long does RSV last in older people? The duration of RSV, respiratory syncytial virus, in older people can vary depending on various factors, including the individual's overall health and immune response. In general, RSV symptoms in older adults may last for one to two weeks, similar to other respiratory infections. However, it's important to note that recovery time can vary, and some individuals may experience lingering symptoms or complications that require additional medical attention. Conclusion RSV can pose a significant health risk to older adults, but by understanding the symptoms, risks, and preventive measures, you can take steps to protect yourself or your loved ones. Stay informed, practice good hygiene, and seek medical attention promptly if needed. Remember, if you have any specific concerns or questions about RSV in older adults, it's always best to consult with a healthcare professional. By prioritizing RSV awareness and implementing preventive strategies, we can ensure the well-being of older adults during RSV seasons. Remember, this video is not intended for medical advice. It is for informational purposes only. It's essential to reach out to your health care professional to get advice for your particular circumstance and know that this video should not be used in place of their advice and input. Thank you for watching. To read the full article, go to www.livingyourseniorlife.com. The link can be found in the video description.